Welcome to My Conversation, a presentation of KAIL-TV, My Central Valley. So let's get My Conversation started. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Welcome to the Friday edition of My Conversation, My Central Valley, KAIL, with your host, Feather DeWise. And I am looking forward to the weekend. And uh, a part of my weekend festivities is going to the grocery store, <laughs> which brings us to our first guest. If you can, please put your hands together for Daniel and Angela Irwin from Clovis Grocery Outlet. How are you? How are you? Good. Good. Thanks for having us. Oh, thank you for bringing me free groceries. <laughs> no? Uh, no? We, we didn't bring you free groceries. <laughs> <laughs> now, now, you guys own? Yes, yes. We own Clovis. and operate Clovis Grocery Outlet. Tell me about Clovis Grocery Outlet. So it's a, it's a full service a discount grocery store where you can get savings of 50% or more on many name brand groceries. Um, we have operated the store since October of last year. Um, it's a lot of fun and, uh, and yeah, that's, that's about it. And that's our show. <laughs> <laughs> no, uh, I, have, I have several questions. I'm not even going to. How does the items end up at, 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 the, at the grocery outlet stores? I mean, is there is there a certain, does it have to go through a certain, I mean, you know, because a lot of people say the same thing about Ross and swap malls, but <laughs> being that it's a, a grocery outlet, mm -hmm. is there a difference with uh, the distribution or how does that work? Well, we have a team of buyers up at corporate that work really hard to get really good deals on items. An example, they, they buy opportunistically. So what go. that means is, um, let's take Coke, for instance. You know how they put Santa on there during Christmas time? Gotcha. Well, you know, let's say they made way more than they ended up selling. So it's a, the other grocery stores won't take the product. So instead, um, we will buy the product off, take it off their hands for them at a discount of a price. And so then we pass that discount on to our customers. And we appreciate yeah. <laughs> the discount. <laughs> um, now, I noticed uh, uh, when you when they said Clovis Grocery mm -hmm. Outlet, I've been passing by the building for a long time. And you guys have been running it uh, since you said since October. October, October. Mm -hmm. but the building has actually been there for a while. Yeah, yeah, it's it's been over, it's it's been a Clovis Grocery Outlet for over 20 years. So now, how did you guys come about the opportunity of taking over the grocery outlet in Clovis? His back background is in retail. And so he just happened upon the opportunity. We looked into it and started the process of um, just learning more about it and then the interview process to be picked as possible future owners and just took it from there. Trained at the Clovis Grocery Outlet for what, about a? Yes, 10 months or so. Wow. And she has a background in, in marketing, so right. it seemed, mm -hmm. to, seemed to be a good fit for yeah. us. So. See, look at that. Not just that, <laughs> not just in real life, a great couple, great business partners as well. You get, what about them peas? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Something off camera I was teasing about. <laughs> now, some of the surprising things you can find at the grocery outlet, it's not just, is it just groceries? It's or are there not. other items that you have as well? All kinds of things. Actually, today I Facebooked about um, this blanket that's a, you know those mermaid blankets that you see ah. around? Um, those we have a selection of for $9.99. And so you can find a lot of unique things, um, but just anything from gardening to uh, personal health items, it's, there's a lot. We actually have a NOSH section. It's um, natural, organic, specialty. And healthy. Yeah. And healthy. Yeah. I'm so glad you wrong. said that because I was sitting <laughs> <laughs> Nosh. Uh, <laughs> and um, it's all kinds of clean labels, gluten-free, um, just everything focusing on healthy items that you can find at other stores but at a fraction of the cost that a lot of people don't realize. We have different Nosh sections throughout this store and we're really proud of them because we can offer healthy food to yeah. people at a price that they can actually afford. So, And that's one of the things mm -hmm. that, is, that is a great reward about having a grocery outlet is mm -hmm. that you can find some things because eating healthy mm -hmm. can yeah. run you a tab. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I it mean, can be expensive. <laughs> right, right. It can get up there and knowing that you can come out to Clovis Grocery Outlet and find some things at discount. Mm -hmm. I mean, everybody like a discount. Right, right. Yeah. And you know, mm -hmm. no doubt. everybody <laughs> like a discount. You can have something yeah. for a dollar. They'll be like, well, what about 80 cent? <laughs> 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 now, is there, are there any uh, standing uh, specialty items that you guys uh, like to push and promote the sales the most at the grocery outlet? That's part of what is fun about the grocery outlet is um, 
there are things that we always have. We always have milk, eggs, the basics. Right. But the items we have, it's always changing depending on what we were able to buy opportunistically. So a lot of people shop there for the fun of it, seeing what you know bargains and what treasures they're going to find that week or that day that they come. Um, something we were really interested in getting into the business is we like the business model, which is um, you know each store is individually owned and operated, right. and um, a huge part of being owners is making sure that you're giving back to the community. Definitely. So that was an aspect that was really important to us, and something that you know we strive to do constantly is figure out ways we can give back to the com community. I know we've lived in the Fresno Clovis area for how many years now? Oh, 13 years 13 now. 13 years yeah. and uh, Clovis itself for about four now and we just love the community and that was why getting a store here in Clovis was so important to us. Um, you want to talk about Yeah, yeah, R real quick. Uh, July was uh, a month where we raised uh, funds to, to feed the needy so we had uh, Independence from Hunger campaign. That's awesome. Um, yeah, we raised over $6,000 for uh, St. Martha's Food Pantry, which is right down the street from our store. And uh, yeah, it was a lot of fun and, and mm -hmm. our, our employees and, uh, and our customers. customers made this happen. So we're, we're awesome. something we're really proud of. So right. we, do, we do something like this every year, so. It's yeah. a great blessing mm -hmm. when you're able to go ahead and mm -hmm. give back and being that you're the exactly. owners and knowing how community-driven Clovis is, mm -hmm. yeah. right. that's absolutely priceless. Mm -hmm. um, now, I know where it's at, mm -hmm. you know, and I'm <laughs> going to come in for that <coughs> free bag of groceries. But uh, <laughs> for our viewers out there, tell them exactly where you are and how they can contact you. Uh, so we're at 1848 Clovis Avenue. We're on the northwest corner of Shaw and Clovis. Um, we are kind of hidden, so um, we're behind the Carl's Jr. Most of us know where that Carl's <laughs> Jr. is. Um, so, uh, and you can also uh, find us on Facebook at Clovis Grocery Outlet. Well, we absolutely thank you for being on the show. Thank you so much. Please put your hands together one more time for Daniel and Angela Irwin from Clovis Grocery Outlet. We'll be right back after this. <laughs>